Alrighty, welcome back everyone, I am Blaze here. In today's video, I'm going to be going over what I consider to be the 8 coolest armor sets in EverQuest. So fortunately, I have a lot of illusions on Aeonic, and I can demonstrate most of them. Now, if you disagree with my list, or you think there's some other cool ones, please let me know in the comments below. Let's get to it. So, the first one I want to get to is barbarians i think barbarians all across the board have really really good looking armor sets all right so this is the first one let's put the helmet on too let's there i really like the sort of roman gladiator theme and the norse theme that's in barbarian armor i love the the viking helmet here and just the full plate appearance looks amazing. And on the Velius, I don't necessarily like all the Velius textures for Barbarians, but I really like the Velius helm. It looks so cool. It looks really cool. But let's go check out. So that's number one. I'm going to say Barbarian plate. And these are in no particular order. I just like them all. But that's number one on the list. Let's take a look at number two being Barbarian Chain, which I think also looks really, really good. It's sort of keeping the same motif of like a Roman gladiator, I guess. Yeah, that looks really cool too. The chain mail looks really, really nice. Fits well on rogues too and on shamans. Or can shamans use chain? I thought they were leather only. I don't know. I don't know anymore. But that is number two. Let's go to number three, which is... I like barbarians even in leather, too. They're one of the best leather textures. That could be taken out of context real bad. <laughs> now that I know it. Yeah, so same. I, I like these little epaulets that are right on the corners here and the kilt is really nice touch and the helmet i love the barbarian the uh all the helmets are really solid for barbarians but the the polar bear helmet's really really cool looking so that's number three now let's go to half elves oh human uh, human armor just doesn't look that good good in general but let's go to half elf so man this mask was a pain to get Bruno's of the half breed but half elves that looks ugly I don't really like half elf plate that much but I do like half elf chain half elf chain looks pretty nice Yeah, I, I, I find that I like this kind of armor too. Now, the, the gloves are a little bit out of character. I don't necessarily like the gloves the way they look. But this sort of chainmail look that's uh, got this yellow color, it's really, really nice. And I also like half-elf boots. They're very distinctive. The sort of cuffed... Let me see if I can change... I'll change boots to be something else so you can actually really see them I, I really like the the sort of cuff boot thing they have there too it's it's what really separates them from the other elves in my opinion that's the one distinguishing features that you can really tell that's a half elf and that's say a wood elf or whatever it might be but number four I'm gonna say is half elf and chain now the next one I also like is high elf and chain Let's show that one. Guys, the Gorser just did a video on this mask. It's doing a large part of the Rogue Epic 1.0. I really like this one. I really like this one because the webbing, the the webbing, sort of like a Spider-Man feel, but all the the high elf armors have this webbing on the, uh, the arms. Helmet's pretty good looking too. Let's take a look at the. Velius texture helmet. It's like a cat thing. I, I don't necessarily like that one as much. But um, 
I think that looks solid. I th chain also looks pretty solid on high elves, but I, I definitely prefer the plate a lot more. Yeah, that looks solid too, because you still have the webbing there. Sort of your classic old school cleric look. Next, let's go over Dark Elves. I think Dark Elves has some of the most solid, solid outfits. Dark Elf and Plate. It looks amazing. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. What really sells it, I, I like the, how the, the pants are when you're looking from the backside. I like this sort of dress in there. But I also, the, what really sells is the helm. The skull helm looks so, so cool. Don't necessarily like the Velius textured helm as much. Yeah, this is the Velius textured helm. Don't really like this one as much. It looks kind of janky, but definitely the skull helm is really, really cool looking. And for these next two armor sets, I'm actually not going to be able to show it here. I'm going to have to actually log out and re-log back in because of the Velius textures. But we should be at number six going into seven right now. So I'll come back. Okay, so if you want to get the Velius textures off the armor, there's a little bit of tweaking you have to do. I'm actually going to leave how to get this in the description, what you're going to want to copy and paste. But you go to the EQ client file in your EverQuest folder. And you're going to do a little bit of editing here. And the part that you want to throw in is all of that. So I am going to copy and paste this. I'll give you guys this in the description. You can throw it in your EQ client file and it will make everything good. But you're only getting the Velius textures if you have the old models enabled. So let's go show what it looks like, shall we? So these are the Velius textures. You first get the ability to get this armor look from doing the quested armor stuff in Velius, like for Sky Shrine, Kale, or the or Thurgoden quest. And some of them look really, really, really cool. And what's nice too is you also get a lot of the same Velius textures in the Planes of Power gear, so you keep it on. But the only thing I didn't like about the Planes of Power gear is that all the helmets had no graphic at all. And I think the human Velius textures for the plate looks really, really cool. But what really sells it for me is this. I think this is the coolest looking helm in the game. The human dragon helm. I always had this on whenever I could. I think this one's just amazing. But unfortunately, the best gear I got doesn't have any texture. This was a Lona helmet. doesn't have any texture. It's just no helm. So I think human plate, especially with the helmet, looks amazing. That's one of the ones on the list. I think we are at seven. Next one is Dark Elf on Velius. Dark Elf plate on Velius looks real solid. Now, I don't like the Dark Elf helm for Velius, but I do like the way the armor looks. Sort of this red, a lot more like Innerook vibes here with all the red and yellow. And this like skull and I don't even know what that is, but the plate is really shiny here. And on the last one I'll mention, number nine, is High Elf. High Elf Velius textures look awesome, too. Yeah, I just love the look of that. It's like they still have that sort of same... I don't know, webbing, you'd say? The webbing just looks awesome, this gold webbing. But, alrighty. Thank you guys all for watching. If you like the video, please go ahead and like and let me know what kind of armor do you guys like? What, what's the coolest looking armor sets that you guys personally like from the game?